think she's really brought three things, I would say, as a director. Um, she's an enthusiast. Um, she knows her comedy. Uh, and she's very direct uh, and um, decisive. Uh, and yet she's also collaborative and open. So she's, she's a rare combination of, of the sort of director you really want to work with. Um, and she's delivering uh, on, on all those levels. It needs to be an underdog story and it needs to be about redemption. Uh, it needs to be about maybe they got a little bit big for their boots and, you know, pride does come before a fall. Um, and how could we affect that and then build them into, you know, a satisfying uh, storyline, um, which I think we've done. I think it feels, it feels organic. We've taken them out of the college world into a bigger competitive world. You know, they have a particular nemesis that they have to compete against and they have everything on the line. The entire legacy of the Bellows is on the line. So the stakes couldn't be bigger. Part of what we obviously wanted to address in this film is this is for a lot of the girls, it's their last year at college. You know, they're, they're moving on and there's all the angst that goes with everybody when they're staring real life in the face. Uh, and part of what we wanted to explore was actually the real lessons and validity of companionship that, uh, that people find at college and have found in the Bellas in our film uh, and how that strength not only works w within the moment that we have in this film where they have to, to find a redemptive path, but you know, going forward, the Bellas, they'll always be pals, they'll always be Bellas. That was part of what we thought was quite affecting.